Well, six miles west of Moose Jaw on Caribou Street, looking westwards towards the Missouri Cateau and Boharm, Saskatchewan, Saturday afternoon, August 20th, 2011, and looking northwestward up the Thunder Creek Valley. Help drain Glacial Lake Regina. That's the big Viterra terminal in Moose Jaw, built by the Saskatchewan Meat Pool in 1965. 100,000 metric tons. And this is the school near Bohar. The district was 189, and I haven't found an actual Boharm school, and don't know the name of this one. And looking into Boharm from the south, southwest a little bit, I think. Sitting on the bed of Glacial Lake Regina, drained about 11,000, 10,000 years ago. Held by Thunder Creek, contributed to the drainage. And coming around to look north up the grid. Range Road 280. Down there is the Canadian Pacific Main Line built through here in 1882. Got as far west off to the left as Tompkins, that building season. Not sure where they started. Eastern Saskatchewan somewhere. What was then Assiniboia. Nice stand of grain. Ripening in the August sun. Soon be harvest time. Rich, rich soil through here, silts and clays, and there's the rise of the Missouri Coteau down there to the south, and to the west, the third prairie step, and a little sign. And this is the sign. And here we are down looking along the rail line back towards Moose Jaw. Even though the rail line was built through here in 1882, there wasn't a station raised here until 1911 at mile 8.2 of the Swift Current subdivision, the standard western line stations. It's right along here somewhere. And demolished at a time unknown. Look like a pair of AC 4400 CWs, General Electric locomotives. Heading off for Calgary. The elevators would have stood along here, of course. There was no Saskatchewan wheat pool presence here in 1924, but showing on the 1933 map, there was an elevator. And on the 1984 map, still, that's seven mile down there, siding out. But the Saskatchewan wheat pool elevator was gone by 1995. I don't know what other elevator companies were represented here. Probably a couple, maybe Searle, Pioneer. Land Railway Avenue. First 1890 post office was opened here in town. 
closed on May 15, 1976 with the resignation of the last postmaster. It was named after a place in Scotland, Bochairn. the population is here. Less than a hundred I would hazard. Never was a village. Always a hamlet. A ward of the RM of Moose Jaw. Number 161. That might have been a hotel there, do you think? Maybe. Can work on the garage. A lonely playground. Looking back over Bow Harm from the northwest, along Range Road 280. If you squint, you can see the little red schoolhouse on the hill in the middle distance there on the other side of the tracks. On the horizon, the Missouri Coteau steps up to the high plains from the bed of Glacial Lake Regina. Maybe 400 feet goes up. I'm just guessing. A quiet Saturday afternoon in Boharm, Saskatchewan. 